So this time we're going to move on or progress the reverse sweep what we've just worked on. And what we're going to look to do is start in a conventional stance. So for me, I'm a left-hander, so I'm going to start in my conventional left-handed stance. If you was a right-handed batsman, you'd start in your conventional right-handed bat right batting stance. So we, this time we're going to place the ball between our chin and our back shoulder. We're going to get in our stance. So imagine we're facing the bowler from straight on. We're going to then cross over our feet. So we get into then a um, conventional, for me, it's conventional right-handed stance. And look to um, drop the ball and try and hit the ball between the targets. So I've got the blue disc here, which is straighter. So the blue disc is straighter. And again, I'm going to look to try and hit in front of square um, between the blue targets here. The yellow disc is on the leg side of a right-handed, of a right-hander. So it's going to be hit, looking to hit further behind square. So catching up with the ball and looking to hit the ball behind square. So I'll give a demonstration how it goes. So we go blue disc first. Again, lead with that front shoulder. So that front shoulder makes sure it goes towards the ball. Or sorry, your front shoulder goes towards the target. There you go. And I'll give one more demonstration on the blue target. Again, it's important to move into our right-handed stance quickly. Um, but again, make sure you've got control over the shot and got a good balance in the shot. Okay, so every time you get the ball through the target, you're going to score four runs. Every time you miss the target, you're going to lose a wicket. How many runs can you score without being dismissed ten times?